Artists are making big headway with their new art. Kelloland's Max Hofer brings you the story. Max? Thank you, Matt. Now, two high school seniors are being recognized nationally for their works in photography. Senior Jada Carlson has only been doing photography for two years. I just recently like got a camera from my aunt, and it's not the best camera. It's just a kit camera that's like $500, which is still a lot, but it's pretty like basic. What isn't basic is how far she's come in such a short time. Her art was selected along with eight others to hang up in the Young Artist Gallery at the Washington Pavilion. Now you could say that Carlson takes these photos in her sleep. Literally, this is actually a picture of her sleeping. But professional art critics aren't sleeping on her work. Last year, for her picture called Quiet, she earned a gold key from the Scholastic Art and Writing Awards. They go over like 360,000 or something like that and select like top ones. She was then picked to represent the South Dakota region in New York, where she accepted a gold medal for the piece. And that puts her in the top 1% in the nation. So when she had her work go to um, New York, there are 240,000 pieces of writing and art that they're judged against with um, nationally and internationally. Another one of her works, Chair, has received a gold key this year. And she isn't the only student in her class earning praise. Fellow classmate Heather Eller also won a gold key this year. I'm so excited. Like, it's so cool to know that, like, um, like they thought I deserved the gold key. It fills my heart with joy. I am just so tickle pink when they come in and tell me about what they're doing and about how they are able to problem solve. Even like if I don't win like the gold medal, like it's super cool to be like recognized for like the art that I make. That piece isn't currently displayed at this exhibit, but what is on display is the pride of students who not only earn keys for their work, but to their futures. Like I don't want to ever not do this, which is why I plan on going to art school. I'm hoping to get into like marketing and advertisement photography, so hopefully into some pretty cool colleges that are out of state. 